Hi, it's Cake Up Kristen, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get this eye. I'm using my 35OM Morphe Brushes palette, and I'm digging into this shade right here with this fluffy blending brush that I got from the Wish app, and I'm blending that into my crease. I'm also blending that a little bit above my crease towards my brow bone. Now I'm digging into this darker brown and blending that into my crease to add a little bit more depth, but I'm keeping it below the first shade that I applied. I'm using a very light hand and moving in circular motions as well as sweeping the brush back and forth to blend that in really well. Still using that same brush, I'm digging into this even darker shade and working that into my crease as well, and I'm keeping it below the second shade that I applied. You can use a smaller blending brush to target that area better, but I'm using the same fluffy brush, but I'm using just the edge of the brush instead of the whole top of the brush. I'm digging into that first shade I used and blending that into my crease, making sure there are no harsh lines between the three colors. Next, I'm digging into this dark chocolate shade and I'm blending that out with the small tapered brush by Morphe Brushes. I'm focusing that shade just on my outer V. I actually wanted my outer V to be a little bit darker, so I'm using my Rose Gold palette by Huda Beauty and digging into Black Truffle, and I'm focusing that color on my outer V. Switching back to that first brush, I'm blending out my outer V, and I'm doing this very lightly because I don't want to move around the product, I just want to blend out those harsh lines. Next, I'm digging into the shade Sandalwood and applying that on the first half of my lid with my finger. To brighten that area up a little bit and add a little sparkle, I'm digging into Moon Dust and applying that on the first half of my lid as well with my finger. Then I'm blending out those edges with a clean fluffy brush. Moving on to the bottom of the eyes, I'm going back into my Morphe Brushes palette and using the shade once again, but instead I'm taking it up on this flat brush to smoke out my bottom eyes. Next, I'm digging into this darker brown shade and blending that out on my lower lash line. I'm digging into this dark chocolate shade and blending that out on the outer half of my bottom lash line. I'm going back into my Huda Beauty palette into Black Truffle and blending that out on top of the dark chocolate shade that I applied. To make my inner corners pop, I'm using my flat brush by Morphe Brushes, and I'm going to spray that with the setting spray by NYX in the dewy finish. For highlight, I'm using that glow kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills and digging into dipping in gold with my flat brush and highlighting my inner corners. To brighten up those corners even more, I'm digging into sunburst and applying that on top of dipping in gold. For a little bit more definition, I'm going back into Black Truffle with a small flat brush by Morphe Brushes and outlining the inner corners of my eyes on my bottom and top waterline. 
I forgot to show you guys this product, but this is the Fenty Highlighter Stick, and I'm just taking some up on my flat brush that I use to highlight my inner corners and highlighting my brow bones. Oh, and this is in the color Confetti. Then I'm blending that out with a clean fluffy brush. To coat my lashes, I'm using the Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara and applying that to my top and bottom lashes. For lashes, I'm using a pair from Bold Face Makeup, but I don't remember which style it's in. But y'all should check out their website because their lashes are bomb and their lashes, I believe, are only below $9. And this is the final look. I really hope you guys like this look. This is like my go-to everyday look when I don't know what to do. If you recreate this look, please tag and hashtag KakeUpKristen on your pictures so that I can check out your work and spam your pictures. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos. Stay caked, stay fierce, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.